Okay. Hi, I'm here from Two Fees in a Bucket to show you the new Tim Holtz collections that just came in. This is the new print tray configurations. Um, there's a whole series of these that Tim Holtz has out that has these little removable blocks and that you can move around and so you can make it to display however you want it to be. Um, and on the back of this one, he actually gives you a couple of different ideas um, of ways that, that you can put all the different blocks to create space for all of your special treasures and altered art items. This is the new craft resist paper pad. It's 24 papers in here. It's made of thick, heavy craft cardstock. Um, most of them are printed, and then they're also printed with this um, dark craft color ink, I guess, I should, kind of gold um, resist, so that when you paint over them, um, it will resist the paint and the ink, so those, those parts will stand out in the pattern. Uh, they will not take the color dye to them. Some of the different patterns. Okay, and then this is the um, crowded attic paper pad. You have 36 um, papers in here, and they're double sided. Really great for collages, altered art maps. I haven't seen any that are the same. Oh, and then here's um, quadrants. So you get a six, whole bunch of six by six papers in here as well as the 12 by 12, which is really nice since everybody's loving the six by six. Oh, and there you have it even smaller. Okay, now there's a lot of other items too. This is the newsprint alphabet. There's 159 alpha and punctuation pieces on here. You can just punch these out. These are not adhesive. Um, this one has 126. This is the ransom alphabet. This is the salvage stickers uh, crowded attic. This goes with the um, that other paper pad collection. Um, and all different kinds of alphabet stickers in here. Different styles, um, numbers. All kinds of really great things. Architecture and maps. And they're really heavy and thick. Really nice quality. So there's that. Scrunge blocks. 84 blocks. Is that right? 84 blocks and 115 letters. Nice. Here's you can see all the different alphabets and then here's the different blocks. They're designed to layer with thicker grunge board base shape to resemble printer blocks. So you can paint them and do all kinds of fun stuff with those. Now there's a lot of different other pieces that he has too um, for all of the different altered projects and jewelry and things and for putting in your, your treasure boxes. These are the fractured dolls. The fractured dolls are made, um, are broken and glazed. Little dolls, you have a bigger one and then a tiny one, they have no arms. The accoutrements, these are shabby buttons. You have 10 buttons. 90 game pieces. This has 10 light bulbs. Really fun. Um, nine plaques, number plaques with long brads to go with them. And uh, nine corked vials of all different sizes. Some are skinny, this one's really tall with a thin neck on it. Um, hanger clips. I don't know if you can see that. It's got kind of a little spiral in there, so it's like a paper clip, but it looks like a hanger. 12 pen nibs. This is a pocket watch. One watch frame. Embellished with, a, with a time, mimicking a timepiece that is carried in the pocket, which can be filled with photos or other dimensional objects. Very nice. These are little tassels. See, a couple more tapes. We've had all these different tapes in the past. These are the tissue tapes. This one is sketchbook. There are two rolls with 16 yards each. This has kind of butterflies um, on it, and this is all kinds of different postmarks and writing things. And this one is called Journeyman. Looks like there's tickets and stuff like that on this one. Binder rings to make your own binder. And it has the little um, brads in them also, so you can put them into the binding of a book, create your own book. There's two different sizes there. These are craft glassine envelopes, 
large, um, this is a six tag envelopes and this is um, 10 ATC size envelopes. I'm gonna take one out so you can see. Glassine envelope. They're kind of um, waxed a little bit, almost kind of see-through. It's kind of hard to see in here, but you can actually kind of see through them a little bit. For clear glassine, you can usually see through them, a little transparent, a little thing like that. Okay, and one more thing is um, the reinforcer stickers. There's a hundred in here. And these are, reinforcer stickers are the kind of stickers that would, you would find on a tag to reinforce them so you can put them in a binding so they have a little hole in them. So you can put them around um, your, on your page where you would put the binding ring or the, the ribbon to tie them together. So that's it. That's all of the new Tim Holtz that we have today. Thanks.